So this is an acrostic poem that I wrote about Quartz Mountain, and it spells out Oklahoma Arts Institute. It's called QM Rocks. Outside for the first time in months, city skin adapting to the sun and culture of the mountains. We are not used to so little talk of Kevin Durant. This is our oasis, where the kids in orchestra t-shirts quoting Shakespeare, notebooks in hand, cameras around our neck, where the kids who secretly like Hamilton, who don't have to lie and pretend we care about the Thunder postseason during our two-week arts vacation. And as long as we stay away from the lake, we'll be just fine, maybe, trying to deny the existence of a home away from Lone Wolf, away from the new heroes and friends and the overwhelming sense of community I discovered when my mom and I were driving to check in. We heard the music, the mountains in the distance, the day I decided a fear of rejection wouldn't keep me from Quartz Mountain. But I will always believe that everything happens for a purpose. My one summer here, reason enough to keep me going, when at times it's so hard to write, I wish that my parents had forced me into STEM, so my life could be steady income, NASA bound, engineering a future with zero grounds of follow-up questions of backup plans. But for now, I'm going to be present be with these talented people and try to enjoy the nights I have left remembering each of them. All the evenings we spend on the lawn holding needles and yarn in a circle, calling ourselves the social network, laughing because the equivalent of Kevin Durant here at Quartz is the mosquitoes and we have personified them into our artistic villain. And I am not the best at ballroom, but my friends and I swing dance in my room after lights out, all of us leading swaying to the sound of the air conditioning. So thanks for this, creative writers, dancers, actors, instructors, painters, photo takers, filmmakers. Thanks to every artist for understanding that this is the education kids don't forget. No matter how many showings of the Tonys we miss, this is it. Our summers spent hidden in our artistic paradise with the mountains closing us in every morning watching the sun rise as we try to find our voice out here in the arts capital of Oklahoma.